has come out of The Daily Show with your correspondence. Yeah. And I'm wondering, what about The Daily Show environment in general or your leadership in particular do you think led to the growth and development of such talented actors and talk show hosts? Brock. <clears throat> <laughs> when you are a facilitator of men, <laughs> if I may, um, I mean, some of it honestly is happenstance. Uh, we were fortunate to be able to identify really talented people and have the pleasure and honor of having them come in and, and work with us. And hopefully the environment was stimulating enough for them and, and, and collaborative enough for them that they were able to express themselves to their best ability. And I think that's, I, you know, my feeling about those environments is always simply have a clarity of vision, but a flexibility of process. So the idea being, know your intention. You know, it's the one, the only thing that you can ever control is intention. You can't control people's perception of it. You can't control what they make of it. But you can control through your own sense of moral foundation or barometer or whatever it is that, that, that makes you tick, what your intention is. And then you try and execute that intention to its best uh, avatar, to its best self. And, and that's what we would try and do in the show. And we were fortunate to have access to the kind of talent that, that we did. So I don't know that there was anything inherent in the atmosphere as much as in the same way that I felt like talking about issues in politics would make it more interesting, we were able to find performers that also felt that way. And together that created, I think, a, a certain energy for part of the process.